You know, I don't like to tell you because then I don't get your honest opinion, okay? I'm always honest. Welcome back to She Show Videos, where I'm your host, Brittany Washington, and this is Elizabeth Taylor. <coughs> we are Hi, back guys. In the garage, if you couldn't tell. Sort of like a shed, but larger with a lot of stuff in it. It's a little cluttered. It's almost spring cleaning time. Before we even you start. You don't even need to clean in here. Before we even start, please subscribe to our channel, okay? We've been around for over a year. Mm -hmm. It's the time. We're doing it big. Look okay. at these faces. No. Oh. Look at her titties. Look at my face. Maybe, remember those Barbie things that you like put a different head on it and then a shirt and then pants oh, yeah. is like a stencil? That's like us. I want like your skin tone, obviously my face. Your lips, though. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take what I got. Okay. What well. the good Lord gave me. Hmm. He gave you me. He gave you me. Some it's things like a I'd like to song. return. Okay. Some things that he gave me, I'd like to return. Listen, what are we talking about today? It's kind of nice out. Well, it's chilly. Well, but it's sunny. Like 48 degrees, and it is sunny. Today we're talking about dating in your 30s. Okay. So I'm a great person to talk about this. With. No, you're not. It's mostly me Tell talking me some things. So this is what has been happening recently. Okay. Oh. Okay. Buckle up, Buttercup. Buckle up. It sounds horrible. I should have poured an alcoholic beverage into this cup. So remember, we have one friend who mm -hmm. likes the appearance. Well, we actually have more than one friend who likes the appearance of younger men. Yes. Okay. So remember you were at the wedding and you were asking your friend like, which guy here would you pick? And she picked a guy that was like 15 years her junior. Right, Cause and then we talked about how like their taste stalled maybe yeah. at the last time they were dating. actively mm -hmm. dating. Yes, okay. all, of, all of our friends who fit into this bucket, that seems to be the Overarching the theme, right? Yes, I agree. So then we have another friend who's like, oh, she likes them this shape and they typically look younger. Mm -hmm. And she was mm -hmm. like, oh, they're that age. I, ooh. And I was like, <laughs> and I was like, yes. huh. So, yes. specific type. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, I know you know, recently people have been finding out that I'm on the market again. In case you didn't know, Brittany's on the market again. Don't DM me. Please do not DM me. You can me. DM me though and I will sort of see if you're worthy do and then pass on as necessary. Somebody's been DMing us and I had to shut them down recently. D do not DM me is my final offer. I appreciate your interest. I've been getting some weird DMs. Okay? Weird. I'm about to start a fake account and DM you. <laughs> no. I'm a I you. No. Maybe we'll fall in love. So, most of the gentlemen who have been DMing me. Genitalia? No. Thank God. It's just been like neither here nor there. Okay. Are older gentlemen. Mm hmm. How much older? So one guy was like, my dad's age. I'm into that. Oh, oh I'm into your, that's different. Okay. <laughs> okay, but I get what you're saying. Okay, so, so I'm older gentlemen. Myself, like, maybe you're, a tr maybe it's cause you're so mature. That, when you're attracting a. So I thought to myself, what am, like, what is the aura that I'm putting out into this world? I'm looking at your cardigan right now. This is and lived I'm, in, okay. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Okay, continue on. <laughs> Do you want to be the potter of the kettle today? I'm, listen, I'm into old dudes, so me and Hugh. Get stuck. Okay. So I was like, okay, maybe it's what I'm putting out into the universe. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, as they come... Stop talking about my dad. Maybe that's the key here. Oh, I don't just talk Stop about Stop talking dad. about my dad. I swear, I will knock this <laughs> over. I will break share. That's bad karma. Continue on. So then I think to myself, is it the same for men as it is women? Like, do men think that they should just automatically receive a younger gal? Just like some women think that I they- I hope not. 
Because that sounds like entitled. I feel like the first couple I was like, oh, thank you, but no, thank you, you know? Mm -hmm. Kind. Uh, Kindness. Like, I just, I feel as though... But do you have a single son? Did you say that? I wanted to be like, I'm... Yeah, well, the one guy recently, he was kind of persistent, which was weird because we've never met. I don't know who he is, and he lives somewhere like hours away. And he was like, can we meet up? That's a serial killer. That's how you get stuck with the meat hooks. <laughs> okay, and I was like, no, thank you for your interest. I appreciate your time. You're very nice. Uh-huh. Your compliments. I know. That's what I was like. I appreciate your time. Because, you know, I barely respond to my own social media. I know. That one guy was messaging our shisha. Oh. I told him you're going to F up our response time, okay? I got I nothing to say him. to you, sir. I responded. Thankfully, you didn't like my response. I don't even know what you responded. I'm I funny. Saw it Period. <laughs> that, I felt like that was a nice way to shut it down. But I'm thinking. Next time I'm going to tell them we're lesbians. We are lesbians. Do not message us. Do not message us. That's true. Because. Especially on she show. That's just a weird. I know. That is our. This is our business. That's does weird. it make any money? No. But that doesn't make it any less of a business. So then I thought to myself. Is that my age range now? Am I up to like 50, 60 year old? No, now? you're not up to 60. I don't even think you're up to 50. You're up to mid 40s for sure though. Is this like when somebody said you look like you could be their next stepmom? Is that what I- <laughs> That was fucking rude. Okay. But I do feel like, have you seen that meme that's like, I'm at the age where I could like date the son or the dad? I- You are at- I think we're at that age because Am you, I our friends who are like, oh, I would never date that person even though they're my age? No. You would date people our age. I, you know, I don't think you wouldn't not date people in their mid-40s. I also don't think you wouldn't not date someone in their late 20s. Like, I feel like your range is not as broad as the one we've set for my mom, who's still single, by the way. So, get on that. Okay. Literally. So you're not a 40 to 80. But I do think you're probably like a 30 to 45. I know. 45 sounds old, but you're almost there. I swear to God, I will burn this house down. Burn the garage. I will burn the this garage Chris down. Taylor's prized possessions <laughs> Exactly. Are. I can't burn the van, so I will burn this garage to the ground. If that's what it takes. 30 to 45, I think, is your range. Oh, my God. I'm dating somebody's dad. You're somebody's mom? <laughs> when you say it, that hurts. That cuts like a knife. You are somebody's mom. You have birthed You're somebody's a child. mom. I, not stepmom, though. You could be somebody's stepmom. I could be. If Chris Taylor died of natural causes. I don't want other kids, though. I don't need that baggage, so... So you would date a guy without kids? You wouldn't date a guy with kids? You'd have to have grown kids. You don't I'm have grown kids. With money. You don't have grown kids. Well, we're gonna get a nanny. My life For is your kids. <laughs> this isn't about me. This is about you. Okay. So you're getting a nanny for your two kids. I, I might. Okay, Oprah I'm money. <laughs> Anyways. They don't want you with, if they have Oprah money. You have dated into the 40s. That is true. But that was like a willing... That was like a willing decision. When you, like, come at me and you're like, you look like my type, I'm almost offended. Like, bitch, what do you mean I look like your type? What if he sends you pictures of his exes and they're all like Halle Berry-esque? Then yes, I mean, that you does are. Check out. Maybe he is young at heart. Maybe he's Big Dick Billy. Maybe he's got a lot of money. Maybe he's just like a very kind person with a great personality. I don't know. Have I don't date. Look, I don't look like any 60-year-old man's... I feel like even 40 for a 60-year-old is... I feel like there's a and lot I'm not 40. of celebrities I'm that have 30. very young... Look at Scott Disick. Scott Disick no. looks like he likes any 19-year-old's type. 
But do you think when he messages said 19 year old, they're like, yeah, you're my type. No, they're probably offended too. And then they're like, oh shit, this Scott is the Disick Lord. Is like, this is the Lord. Scott Disick is like 40. And he dates 19 year old girls. That's because Do you he, think they're offended? Yes. They still date him. Two. Two more than zero. <laughs> I First think he's going to get more. <laughs> I think there's going to be more young ladies. He has the money to support his Maybe lifestyle. these guys do. You don't know. Did you look them up? Did you stalk their profiles? Or did you just look at them and say no? I looked at their profile picture and I said, said I'm no. going to take a hard pass on that. Okay. All you know, hard You pass. know what your type is. I don't know what your type is. I'm, it's a little erratic, so it's hard yeah. for me to keep up. But I'll keep picking out guys I think are your type. No, thank you. Because your type or what you think my I type should be. I found an be, older gentleman who is perfect for you. Is he perfect for me? I don't know. I only met him one time. But he <laughs> seemed like he had some okay. promising qualities. I'm going gonna, gonna to regenerate that connection and see you what happens. You also picked Chris Taylor. Did you think he had some promising qualities? <sighs> <laughs> so much stuff in our garage yes look at us now look at me now throwing papers look at me now and this is why i don't now. trust you <laughs> okay anyways it's a hard hard knock life out there for you maybe i should ask him like could you re-enter this conversation not being so offensive to my age maybe because i feel like maybe you should respond do you know that i am only 29 yeah. Do you know that I'm only 30? Question mark. Heart. And when he says yes, say, then speak to me more gently, like I were your daughter. <laughs> That's, That's not the creepy that part. <laughs> I'm like, you can pro you might be one of my dad's friends. What if they what if you had a mutual friend and it was your dad? That would be <laughs> your dad would be so pissed. <laughs> That'd be so funny. Why is that funny? Oh, that would be so... Your dad would be pissed. When I saw his your date of birth, it almost cut me like a pissed. night. First of all, if you put your full ass date of birth online with he, like the year and everything, you're old. You're he, a boomer. He put what his... Was that guy called me a boomer at tennis? That was fucking rude. You know what? You are really starting to age poorly. <laughs> You've been called somebody's stepmom and a boomer. It's fucking rude. <laughs> okay. I look young as shit. from my Botox. But yeah, I feel like... I'm sorry that happened to you. I know. I'm like, I look in the mirror and I still see a, a 21-year-old spry. Do you have your contacts in when you look? I or swear to God. God. <laughs> Is that... I'm I just... I have let me talk to the people, okay? I still see a 21-year-old spry young thing out in this world, okay? But I feel like when they message me and then I go to your profile and I see you were born in the 60s or 60, I, it hurts my spirit. 60? The year 1960? I wasn't even a... You some could of my, you could almost be that person's granddaughter with how young people are having kids these days. I'm concerned. Let me respond to his <laughs> message. Do you know how it cut? Beat. I think this was a karma. I'm going to beat that dude's ass. I, I feel like I could. I karma for me laughing in your face when that guy called you a stepmom. <laughs> well, that I, I latch on to that and I agree. But so, give me this dude's, I'm going to respond to him. He's offensive. He sent me a picture of himself in front of his door stoop in a nice <clears throat> outfit. Maybe it's because you're kind. I am kind, you're right. Maybe, maybe I have kind eyes, that's what it is. Maybe they just, maybe they need a caretaker. That checks out. You worked out. in a nursing home before and okay, get now great care. Here. So maybe they're, okay. it's not like okay. a super, all those guys at the nursing home were trying to bang you and they didn't offend Jerry you. Jerry was 101 years he old. He was trying to bang you and you were not offended. That's because he barely, he would pee in the corner because he didn't know where he was. Maybe 1960 also does that. If he does, if he pees in he the corner. He has dementia. <laughs> Not sad. <laughs> if he pees in the corner at 62 Chris years Taylor old. Chris Taylor peed in my sock drawer once and he was not 62 years old. He was also inebriated. 
not saying it's okay, but saying... <laughs> it's no excuse. Uh -huh, but saying there was a reason behind it. Well, the age range... Okay, then. I don't even have wrinkles yet. Give me time. The dates of birth then. What year were you born? I should say you have to be between the ages of 30 and a uh, rough 45. <clears throat> if your kids are older Bye. than her. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs> okay? 1960? I know. It was like September 14th in 1960. Oh, my God. And then I was like, what? I can't believe you even responded. I said no, thank you, and then he sent me a picture of. I he was I trying to it. entice uh, you. He was like, "You sure? Look at all. Look what daddy. Look what daddy's bringing." It wasn't that good. 